In Activity 6, we are exploring robot motion. Your educational robot can be programmed to move using the VEX software. Let's look at how we can program motion for your robot. This video assumes that you have built your IQ base bot and paired the brain with your software. Here, I have the software open and have created a new program. I need to make sure that I add a drivetrain to the software. To do this, I open the Devices menu and click Add a Device. Choose Drivetrain to Motor. I need to specify the ports to which my left and right motor are connected. I then choose Brain Inertial and accept the default settings. Close the Devices menu. Once I add the drivetrain, all the blocks related to movement will appear in the software. To move our robot, we are going to look for drivetrain blocks. Using these blocks, we can program our robot to move forward and backward, make turns, and set a variety of options. I am going to make my robot move forward. To do this, I drag the drive block to the programming area, choose a direction, and then a distance. When I'm ready to run my robot, I download my program to the robot's brain by pressing the download button and run it to see what happens. It is important to run your VEX IQ programs on the floor so that you don't damage your robot by running it off a table. Now that you've seen a sample program, try writing your own program to go forward. Next, you'll learn about moving backwards.